Okay, the customer has had a failure on the pump. It says card filled by host, customer referred indoors. You're going to click continue. Go to the pump that is highlighted red. Click on it and to the fuel screen and then press start. That will reset the pump. Now it's gray and idle again and the customer can try again without you even having to go outside. So now it's lit up yellow which means they're trying to authorize their card. Sometimes this takes a little bit of time. And you can watch the screen over here. It shows that the authorization has gone through. There's a check mark saying that it's ready to fuel. Back up a little. And now there's a little car icon showing that they are getting gas on pump 5. And you can watch here as their gas pumps pretty slowly. When a pump starts to run really slow like this, now I do have signs out on the pump telling the customer what to do, but they're not always going to listen to that. Oh, maybe they did. Alright, awesome. See, it started to speed up again. And it's good to go. Now also, you can see there is someone fueling on pump 1. If you want to check the status of their pump, you just touch that and look at the screen here. And they're getting Supreme Gas Credit. Shows the price and how much they've pumped already. It's running slow as well. Looks like they may be about to read this on. And then toggle back to pump 5. You can see how they're going. And pump 1 is only up to 97 cents. They're paused. And they turned it off. And this is a problem here because they did not read the sign. This customer couldn't get pump 1 to work because they didn't read the blue sign, which you can clearly see right here on the pump, that blue line there. So let's see how they do on pump 3. They've got their card in. They're checking it out. Pump 5 is finished pumping. Now we're going to check on pump 3 here. And they're running fine. When the customer is getting gas, you'll see an icon like this. This means that the customer is getting gas on pump 5. To make sure that the pump is running correctly and not running slow, you can touch this icon to open up the fuel pump screen and watch as the numbers rise. You want them to rise at least 70 cents per click and they seem to be doing close to that so that's good. You can now hit close to close it out. 